Yes, guys, what's up? Welcome back to another brand new video on the channel. And now today, we do have Shapeshifters Team 3. And now, it's an absolutely ridiculous team. But from what I have seen so far, it is the hardest Shapeshifter team in the pack so far. Now, rumors are that, obviously this video is coming out on a Wednesday. Rumors are that Footies is going to be out this Friday which always makes the game more fun. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what the point of the third Shapeshifters team was. Obviously last year we got like four teams, but if we take a look at the team real quick, it's a very good team, right? But as I said, they're extremely hard to pack. We have El Nasiri, Dembele, Pepe, who are, you know, eh, you know, fodder cards pretty much. But then Rusio, anyone after that, is an interesting type of card. We have a Mario Gotza who could be on that side of average. Roussillon looks like a really good right back. Kyle Walker in goal. I mean, how long have we been asking for that card? A striker, Harry Maguire, which is just absolutely fantastic. That left back, Klosterman, looks unreal. Joel Felix looks ridiculous. A center mid, Hugo Lloris. A five-star, five-star striker, Paul Pogba. A Sol Campbell left wing icon. He's like 30k, but he's got 99 pace. A left mid and a right back, Michael Balak. A Figo, who can play striker or center mid. A Bastian Schweinsteiger, who if I can get that card, he's like the main one I want from this squad. If I can somehow get him, that would be fantastic. And then we have a 98 rated Thierry Henry, who again, looks absolutely ridiculous now in objectives i don't think i'm going to do it this week just because i have absolutely nothing in my club because i haven't actually played the game i've just opened packs this kind of Inga, i don't have enough players to do this but he looks like a very good card um obviously we have a gavi as well who looks pretty easy to complete as you can see there we have once again all the shapeshifter objectives for the xp and stuff i think in next week's video i'm gonna have this most likely I'm not going to take Tony Cruz, and I know a lot of people will take Tony Cruz. Again, I'm not really actually playing the game, so the pack is more interesting to me, just so it helps with fodder and all that kind of stuff. But we do have 10 packs here, and then depending on what kind of fodder we get from these packs, I might do a hero pick, whatever's out. I honestly don't even know. We'll see after we complete this. Um, but here we go. We have to start 481 doubles here. Let's see. Um, if we can see anything half decent from these, some good fodder, that'd be fantastic. Maybe a shapeshifter. You never actually know. You're starting with a Bauman. One of those cards you always see. Christian Pulisic, who was on his way to Milan, of course. We always see a Bauman. We always see a Fabian, a Carlos Soler, a Roberto Firmino, who was on his way to Al Ali. Those types of cards are what we always see in these backup things. Is that Jesus Navas? Hey, you know what? It's actually Carvajal for once. Now, that's... That's something you don't see. It's always Jesus Navas, but we actually got a Carvajal, which actually isn't too bad. Not too bad, I'm not gonna lie to you. Nothing. Absolute Ferran Torres, most likely. It is Ferran Torres and a Geronimo Ruli there as well. Now, our final 81 double right here. Board, 85 possibly, Hakim Ziyech. It is Hakim Ziyech. And the reason I said Hakim Ziyech, because we know it's not going to be Ashraf Hakimi. There's another example right there that I'm talking about. It's just not going to be Hakimi. An 80 times 5 pack. Here we go. You never know. I mean, I don't think it's too good. Portuguese, center mid, Ruben Neves. Hey, there's another one. And again, another player off the Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia and EAFC 24, FIFA 24, whatever you want to call it. I'll tell you what, there's going to be some ridiculous Saudi teams. It's going to be crazy. But now, we have an 83 double pack here. Let's see. Board, of course. Finland. Not Team Apuki, unfortunately. It's Hrdecki. Nothing behind that. Jose Maria Jimenez. I mean, no thank you. 84 double. Here we go. Can we see shapeshifters? Come on. I mean, if it's a walkout, we have the chance of a shapeshifter behind it. It is Marco Ferrati. We have the chance of the shapeshifter behind this. It's Federico Valverde. It's not a shapeshifter, unfortunately. Unfortunately, it is not a shapeshifter. 
Now, we have a triple 84 pack. Here we go. Once again, walk out so we can see a shapeshifter behind it. CDN, Casimir, Fabinho. It is Fabinho. Shapeshifter behind this. Come on. Let's see it. Yori Tillemans and Marcus Llorente. Once again, no shapeshifter. Now, what else do we have here? We have a triple 83 pack now. Same scenario. Walkout. English striker, center back. It's Fakeo Tomori. So I don't think we're going to be seeing a shapeshifter here. David Silva and Luis Alberto. There's two more boards you constantly see. But now, to end off these packs, we have an 84 times 10 here. Can we see a shapeshifter? I've seen a multitude of these and they have all been abysmal. Can we be the one off? We actually get lucky from it. You never know. Here we go. Obviously, I assume we're going to see a walk out here. Hopefully. I stand corrected. I... I stand corrected. Um, wow. Th that is abysmal. That is absolutely atrocious. Um, all right. Well, I'm going to go do some type of SBC, and I'll be back when I have that completed. Oh, my gosh. That was bad. All right, so firstly, we have an 85 times seven, which I gotta be honest, after this, we will be doing the 86 plus player pick as well. I'm just gonna use whatever fodder we get to put into that. But why is it an 86 and an 84 rated squad for an 85 seven? I don't understand that personally. I, I really don't understand that, but it's EA, it's EA. Again, I, I hope for footies they decide to be smart about what they release because that's kind of ridiculous. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. Or you got the ball in that pack. That's actually solid. Um, I'll take an 84 considering it was the only rare gold in the pack. What's going to be here? It's another board to be fair. 85, it's going to be Schmeichel. Whenever you see Danish, you just know it's going to be Schmeichel. Brian Reynolds in that pack. That's actually kind of solid. Uh, Valencia, whatever that is. I honestly didn't read it correctly. I probably swapped a few of the letters around, but you know what? Whatever. Here we go. 85 times 7. Come on. Let's see a shapeshifter here. Our 84-10 was awful. We get a walk out, of course. Brazilian goalkeeper Ederson Allison. It's going to be Ederson. Moving on. Shapeshifter. Boom. Oh my gosh. I mean, we do get one. 93 rated Michael Balak in his right back card. I'll tell you what, he looks very, very good. Four star, five star, medium, high work rates. And he's actually going to be pretty good for our squad because he gets a link to Rudiger. That's actually very good. That's not a bad pack at all. That is not a bad pack at all. And then we could put Fabinho and Diago Aspas into that 86 plus player pick. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'll be right back when I have that completed. Alrighty, and here we go. And now, depending on if this is really good or not, we'll do that hero player pick. Obviously, I know when we do that hero player pick, it's going to be absolutely abysmal. But, we're going to do it anyway, because it's content. But here we go. Fabinho and Aspas, back to the club. Our 1 of 4, 86 plus player pick. Now, I've heard that it's like a guaranteed Kyle Walker goalkeeper card out of this. I don't know if that's true, but here we go. Can we see a shapeshifter? We, we cannot, but we can see a cheeky little Kaylor Navas. Honestly, that is not the best. We are going to go and do that hero pick. I'll be back when I have that done. All right. So, we did complete it. We had to buy one player. We had to buy Allison. Now, once again, I am expecting this to be absolutely atrocious. But we have our 1 of 5 89 plus World Cup Foot Fantasy or Trophy Titan hero player pick. I'm ready for fame. Here we go. Let's see. What is it going to be? Diego Forlan. Absolutely atrocious once again. <sighs> EA Sports just cannot get it right with those hero picks. I don't really know what I'm even expecting. Yaya Torre is even kind of outdated now. I don't know why it's an 86 and 85 rated squad, to be honest with you. But it is. But it is. So, you know... Once again, once again, it's just EA being EA. 
But to close out today's video, hopefully you guys did enjoy. We have, what is it, a small prime gold players back. Let me know what you guys got in your 84 times 10s, 85 times 7s, and all the other stuff that we opened in this video. Let me know. Has your shapeshifters luck been good throughout all three teams? Because this is our final shapeshifters team of FIFA 23 and FIFA in general. Because obviously next year, if we have a shapeshifters promo, it's not going to be on a FIFA game. So, if you did enjoy it, make sure, leave a like, comment, all that good stuff. I'll catch you guys next time very soon, and I'll see you then. Oh,